so in today's video I'm going to be doing a what's on my iPhone so I do not have an iPhone 6 or plus you know but I do have an iPhone 5c and it's just white and yeah I like it so but I hope I could switch you know sooner but I think it, it works pretty good so you know it doesn't matter but yeah so my background is just um picture like of a picture I took when I was at Universal Studios and it was just like plants so yeah I just really like it so I'm just gonna put my passcode and um, so yeah I'm gonna start with the first page well I only have one page so to start off with that so the first thing um, I have is calendar and today is June 4th, 2015. And then I have settings, Safari, App Store, Weather, Notes, Random. Inside of the Random folder, I have Stocks, Compass, Newsstand, Passbook, Maps, Videos, Mail, Voice Memos, and Speed Test, which I do not know what that is, so I'm probably going to delete it. Um, in my next folder, I have Social, and inside of it, I have Instagram, YouTube, Vine, Twitter, Followers Plus, and Followers Plus, like, shows me who's unfollowed me, and who's followed me, and all that stuff, so, yeah, um, next I have Shoebox, which I do really, really like Shoebox, because it stores all my pictures inside, like, if, say, um, if I deleted a picture, like, say I deleted this picture off of my phone, I could like download it right here and it was like send it to my camera roll and then I could just post it again and if I want to delete it it'll just send it back here so it works really good I really like it um, next I have Shopkick Shop Shopkick um, is another good app that I really like because I've recently got a $10 um, reward um, and I really like it because it's $10 I got with just you know walking into the store and I get points so yeah and you could get all these kinds of rewards so yeah as you can see here these are all the rewards you can get you could get Starbucks, GameStop, Old Navy, Best Buy, AMC so yeah you can get all those stores and I really like it next I have Snapchat so yeah but um, I will link my Snapchat down below as well as my Instagram so yeah um, next, I have music, and I just have iTube and Shazam and the music. Um, I really, you know, I really like iTube, but other than that, also Shazam is really good because, you know, if I can't find the song, I just use that, and it's really good. Um, so I have my only editing app. Wait, I have two more, but I deleted them because I really didn't use them, and I didn't really need them. So, um, the app I use is this. V Visco Cam or V S C O Cam, whatever. I don't know how people say it, but I say Visco Cam. And yeah. So you guys can follow me on Instagram. Um if also um I'll do a how I edit my Instagram pictures. So yeah. Um next I have photos and camera. So uh let's see down here I have phone just simple like that FaceTime and messages so yeah um now so that's pretty much it that's what what is on my iPhone so as for how I edit my Instagram pictures hmm so let's see what picture okay okay um let's see Okay. Um. Okay, so let's just get a random picture. Say we get. Let's see. We'll just choose this picture. So I imported this picture right here. So I'm just gonna click on it. Don't mind it, it's not the best picture, I just chose it. So say if I was to choose black and white, I would just turn it down to about 8. 
then I'll choose that. I'll pull up the exposure. Depends on the picture. Every picture is different, so it just depends on how I want it. So, but that that would be like that. No, it would be like that. And then, so yeah, that would be pretty much it. And if I want it to look more clear, I'll like sharpen it up only up to till, and that's it. But um, if I want colored picture, I would. I go for I used to go for G3 I mean at the beginning I used to do P5 but I do not do that no more so I do either G3 or M3 and when it's between those two um, I do not leave it up all the way I use it usually turn it down to about five or six or eight five six or eight so for this one I'll leave it out I'll leave it at six and then I'll click this, which offers like more editing type of things. So um, I'll put the exposure. I'll put the exposure. I'm not sure because like every single picture is different. It's not going to be the same. Like no matter if I was to choose like say it's the type of way how to edit this picture, my next picture won't be the same. But it just depends on how. So I'll put the exposure down. And temperature, I'll put it at 2. I'll sharpen it up a bit at 1. And I'll put it right there. And I'll see like if it matches my feed. Because, yeah, I'm one of those type of people that I try to make my feed look nice. But it's not going to always look nice. You just got to keep trying and all that. So, um... I like my feet, it's not the best, as I know of other people that have way better feet, but I really like mine. Um, yeah, so you can follow me on Instagram, I will also link that down below. So that's pretty much it on how I edit my Instagram pictures and what is on my iPhone. Oh, and as well as for this background, it is also the same as my passcode, like the lock screen, it's the same thing. Um, yeah, it's just like that. So, that is it for my iPhone. What That's it for what's on my iPhone. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Bye.